Mosabri sings about Mecca in a genre not exactly known for godly messages. There's too many songs on the radio nowadays encouraging girls to do bad things. But this Muslim heartthrob knows how to get them excited. This ain't a song about bottles in the club. One of Sabri's latest songs got more than one million views on YouTube. With the West they call him Jesus, in the East they call him Isa, Messiah, Christ, the same person that you speak of. He says, I believe in Jesus was really written for the people of East Tennessee to show them that Muslims revere him. Son of a virgin, they say it is illogical, probably improbable, but God made it possible. Now, I grew up in an area that didn't really have any Muslims. And I was able to see that, hey, we're all more similar than different. For me, I was like, I want to reach out to my neighbors and show that Muslims and, and, and Christians as a whole can experience what I experience. Sabri's song became popular as another video went viral recently. In that one, Fox News host Lauren Green suggests that the Muslim author of a book about Jesus is biased because of his faith. You're a Muslim, so why did you write a book about the founder of Christianity? Sabri says that although Muslims reject the Christian view that Jesus is the Son of God, they do consider him a prophet. There's so much misinformation about Muslims. I mean, to think that a, a Muslim can't talk about Jesus or can't love Jesus um, is, I think, just a wrong idea. And my goal is to dispel that idea. Why does our religion always have to cause division? In reality, we're all more similar than different. Jesus Sabri says he was inspired by Hasidic reggae artist Matisyahu, who gained a wide following rapping about Jewish themes. I just liked how he always had... Um, he didn't have to succumb to, I guess, any of the pressures of, I guess, writing music. And he was different, and um, he had uplifting songs that were spiritual. You know, it's, it's really nice to be a role model for the kids and for the youth and the adults, because there's not too many people doing what I'm doing. By offering an alternative to pop culture, Sabri is actually doing what Christian rock musicians have done for decades, proving that it also works in his religion. Jerome Sokolovsky, VOA News, Washington.